this. Thanks for your sublime. Hey, glad you like the game, Jivies. And these are five good subs again, Battley. Or Batty? I see it, sorry. Thank you, Batty. Incredible cheeses. Uh, Aromana with pepper berry and uh, Asiago. Beautiful. I mean, really beautiful. That is beautiful, the Gordon. Grilled cheese. With this, is a dream come true. Ah, good, a rock. So I'm going to just cut nice big long slices so I can take off the rind easily. Okay. Thanks, the resub, Dobby. The tier one. A little bit spicy. Tyrannosaurus Rex. I mean, so beautiful. And then with the Asiago again down and literally cut off. Thanks, Reese and Quatch. Appreciate it, thank you. There, get the slice. This all seems Let's fine so far. Just cheese nice cutting. Long, luscious, almost like sort of mini bricks of cheese. And look at that. And that's the prime very, duck man and resub. Incredible. Sean the sucks. The secret of the resub sir ankles and give some beans. Sure the bread is not too thin. It's a weird bread to use for grilled cheese, admittedly. The beautiful locally baked country bread. I actually don't think I've ever had grilled cheese on anything but there, goofy fucking butter. wonder bread. And always butter heavily on the outside. You'll see why, especially. When you get that nice doing all right. Hope you're doing well, Raccoon. And thanks for the gift sub, Yuki. Again, cover it with butter. Thanks for the resub, Tom. Okay. And Cena. We'll season the outside with some salt. And then from there, layer your cheese. This seems fine. I mean, so it's a little excessive, but it seems so okay. In a way that it becomes somewhat almost fitted. And the secret behind this grilled cheese is a little bit of kimchi. What? Homemade kimchi, which is going to give a nice spicy texture to that incredible cheese. Yeah, I mean, that's yeah. a little weird, but if Gordon it's says it's good, it's probably it's good. Kimchi. Never eaten it's any of his bad. shit, though. But once it's been Maybe Gordon Ramsay's food just fucking sucks. Breathtaking. Fold that over. And then from there... Push that down. Thank you again, Batty, for Keep another five gift subs. I appreciate it. A beautiful fireplace over there. <laughs> nice and warm. Touch of olive oil in. Beautiful. If Gordon says it's good, it's probably dog shit, I guess. Just lightly. Why use the fireplace, though? Place on the side. Push that down. Bad, holy shit, Batty. Thank you for the fat 20 drop. Jesus Christ. Thank you, Batty. Yeah. As she cooks. Thank you so much. Stop putting some weight on there. And just pushing it down. Good. Yes, this kind of blows. I don't know why you'd use an, a fireplace to cook your food. Push that down. That way it gets nice and crispy. <clears throat> Beautiful. <laughs> Too much each side. Hey, Zuri said, said yeah, that and Asos. And just place your spatula on top and push down. And that helps to get the cheese nicely melted. That is incredible. The kimchi with that incredible cheese, especially with that pepperberry, is just gonna be a wonderful combination. And also, I don't think I've ever had kimchi, so I don't know about that. It seems a little weird. Grilled cheese. Take that out. Turn that over. Look. That cheese isn't melted. It's cracking away. Gordon, it needs to go back. Gordon, put it back. The cheese. No, it's not. It's cold. Oh, 
Gordon, that hasn't melted at all. I mean, that's what happens when you try and cook in a fireplace, I guess. It's like eating a Lunchable. Oh my god. That is incredible. That pepper berry. Spicy. The acidity of that kimchi. And that bread cooked in the open fire. Unironically, it's raw. Wow. It's fucking raw, Gordon. So good. You didn't even melt the cheese. I want to move to Tasmania. That is delicious. Let me know in the has anyone ever eaten Gordon Ramsay's food? Thank you the five gift subs, Mother Lover, and the resub Periwinkle, and the tier one Whale I Never, and the tier one Frosty. I see a couple of yeses, but I feel like those are liars. I bet it sucks. I actually bet Gordon's food is fucking terrible. Where's one of his restaurants? Let me look it up real quick. Is there any in Florida? Uh, Florida. Let's see. Oh, hey, he has a he has a spot in Orlando. Called Fish and Chips Landing. Is that the is that the name? Oh, it's called Big Fish, and it's coming soon. In August of this year, I'm going opening day. And Gordon better be there to serve me fucking cold cheese on a sandwich. Thanks for the resub, uh, Stabby. You think so, Paul? I don't know, he's very loud. Thanks for give some Sandu. Yeah, it'd be pretty wild, Lost Life. I had his food in Hell's Kitchen, Las Vegas, and no joke, it's the best food I've ever had. Really? 